Akshay. His last name is Kumar. We said Akshay. He's a star who goes far. His name's Akshay. He has movies he makes and a trailer has dropped today. Bam, bam. to our stupid reaction to idiots, I'm Corbin. I'm stupid. That's true. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram and Twitter. Twitter. Come on. Juicy content. It's so juicy. And uh, thank you for us on Patreon and follow us on official Twitter account. Uh, and follow us if you like American reactions, follow us on our 2.0 channel. Yep, we get a lot of comments that are saying, hey, did you guys know this movie dropped? Why don't you react to this trailer? And it's an American film and we're like, we, happened a few days ago, guys. Go yeah. on to 2.0. 2.0. 2.0. If you want American. Stuff. But a trailer dropped at, I believe, 1 a.m. our time last night. What? Yes. Uh, uh, this was one we didn't get up for, so I'm sorry. Sorry. But uh, we are getting to it now. But you should be proud, because sometimes when we've done those, the comments are, Corbin, you need sleep. Don't kill yourself. Corbin, you look so tired. I still need sleep. That's true. Uh, but uh, this is called Houseful 4. I don't know if there's a Houseful 1, 2, and 3. Who knows? I hope not. <laughs> I love that they just go straight to 4 like George Lucas did with the Star Wars. He just went straight to New Hope, episode uh, four. You're watching that movie for the first time. People didn't realize it. Wait, episode four? <laughs> <laughs> but it has Akshay and a ton of other people. Creedy. Yep. Yeah. We have uh, Creedy. It's got a bunch of people. Yeah. And there's a lot of names in that uh, title. But uh, I have no idea what it's about, but why not no just get clue. into it? Houseful four. It's not like a take on Full House, is it? I don't think so. That's Here we go. Weird. कहते हैं इतिहास अपने आप को फिर से दोहराता है मतलब जो काम हमने 600 साल पहले किया था शायद हम फिर से वही करने जा रहे हैं और लगता है मेरी तब भी लगी थी और अब भी लगेगी हैरी तुझे कैसे पता Yeah, I was going to say, he's, he's reincarnated. Oh, okay, gotcha. Rajki! Hey! You know, Rajkumariyo ka swayambar kiya Love the mustache. Yeah, it's not him. Yeah, it's not No, it's similar. I'll show you what it is. 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 I'll show you what Hold on, hold on. You know that one? No. Yaskar, 600 years ago. 
Vicky. Hey! Okay, hold on, hold on. Who was that? I, I don't know who that was, because I was still laughing and had the visual in my mind of all of the heads and the things spinning around when whoever was on there that caused you to freak out. Uh, I will show you and you will know immediately. There, it's somewhere in there. That's Nawaz. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go back a little bit. I want to see him do his thing again. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. <laughs> so this is a, I, you can tell us if this is actually a, a it said franchise, but I don't know if there's one, right. one, two, one, two, three, 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 maybe. Um, do they all have to deal with different kite, like different people being reincarnated kind of thing? Right. Because it looks like his in a previous life he was like in Padmabad basically. Right, exactly. It looks, like. it looks very much even spoofy the villain. of Padmabad. Yeah. Even the villain. Very looks, spoofy of Padmabad. Uh, looks like that. Uh, and then uh, he goes and then he gets reincarnated to the modern day time. Yeah. Uh, and everybody is figuring out who they were in a past life and how they're connected now. Yeah. Uh, it, it, That's a funny concept. I gotta tell you. I love the stupid sound effects. I mean, if this is just going to be a stupid, like, Three Stooges, ridiculous... Well, and, and, and Akshay was known for, you know, in his early days, obviously, as we know, for comedy. Oh, man. That's, that's what he was known for. He's one of the we thought funniest... He was, we thought he was Kasari, but... I, and I know he didn't I know he didn't mean to be this... Was, this wasn't... I don't think this was meant to be funny, but my... One of the moments I've laughed hardest on this channel mm -hmm. was when we were watching... We were having the, I think it was the laugh challenge, wasn't it? And the bubble bath happened and we saw a foot come out. Oh, yeah. And I said, if that's Akshay, I'm gonna die. And it was. <laughs> I, that's one of the hardest laughs I've ever had on the channel was oh, Akshay yeah. in the bathtub. Oh, yeah. That was... And he's got some of the awesome 90s, but see, those weren't intentionally funny. So, I, and come on. That little cameo by Nawaz, I'm glad you went back to, to show me that because I was still laughing. I, I heard the voice and I was like, and then I saw the, I was like, that's Yeah, I was right. laughing from the words mm -hmm. and I looked down at what he was saying and I didn't capture who it was. I'm glad you spotted him and brought him okay, back. Okay, so there is a household two, three, and, and okay, one. Okay, yeah. Uh, and it looks themed, just stupid funny. Themed on reincarnation. That's all, that's all, that's all we get. Stupid funny. Uh, this is one of those where don't go in for anything other than just get ready. Have like, fun. like the Mel Brooks movie. Yeah, just have go fun. in and have a good Good time. Released October 25th. Uh, it's also, the director is Farhat Samji. And it's uh, the uh, Chennai Express. Chennai Express, uh, Diwali, uh, uh, Bo Bachan. Bo Bachan. Uh, and I, so he's he's done quite a few, I think. Uh, he, this looks okay. so stupid fun. Uh, oh, he direct, oh, he's a writer of Symbia. Uh, and I guess did Houseful 3. He's a writer on all those that I, that I okay. listed off. Okay, yeah, yeah, writer. Um, so that's good. I mean, it, Great. it means it should have good writing, hopefully, right? I would hope so. <laughs> and just stupid comedy. Just yeah. dumb comedy. I love it. Maybe they were trying to make it a surprise because Nawaz's name is not in the... I'm sure it was. In the title card. I'm sure. You know what it reminds me of a little bit? I don't know that his role will be this large. Yeah, it's probably not big. It reminds me of Tom Cruise in... Uh, oh, Tropic Thunder. Tropic Thunder. Yeah. 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 Oh, it's going to be so fun to see Nawaz stretch his comedy skills, man. Yeah, because uh, he was in, like, from what we've seen, that, that uh, BBMBS thing. Yeah, that's where he got to start, which was a comedy movie. Mm -hmm. And he's done a few comedy films that we haven't seen. Yeah, but we, we, know, we, him as the, we know him as the sizzling, like, Daniel still, Day -Lewis yeah, type, type one of the greatest actor. actors we've ever seen getting to now show off his comedy. And he was big right there, man. He was... He was over the top. I am genuinely excited for this, what seems like a stupid movie, and I mean that in the best way. Yeah, yeah, it definitely looks like a, like a fun, entertaining, I don't know how the others were, so you can tell us if like, they were terrible, and this is probably gonna be terrible, or right. I don't know, because we, we don't, we've never right. even heard of You may one. say, guys, <laughs> do yourselves a favor. Yeah, I don't know, are the, hold on. Who's in the other ones? Is it all Akshay or do they just, um... I don't know. I didn't even know there was anything before this. So, first one, the third one came out in 2016 and that has Akshay Kumar, uh, Bakchan's son. It's really interesting. Jackie, Jackie Shroff. Shroff. It's really interesting because this seems like a one and done kind of premise, but are all of the films the premise about, I mean, if it's still Akshay, is every film a different reincarnation? Reincarnations. That would every be funny. film he's realizing a different life he lived as he's 
had different lives as he's reincarnated. That's a really funny yeah. concept. Yeah. The John second, Abraham? Is the second one. Wow. And then Akshay still. So it's Akshay's franchise, basically. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know how they are. He's like, you, you're going to the ones that are going to have to tell us how they... Do we need to see the other ones? Yeah. Because uh, there are some comedy franchises that you don't need to see the other it ones. It doesn't look like we need to. Cause it like Police like Academy, just... you don't need to see the other Police Academies. You yeah. just... See Police Academy. Police Academy Four. Oh yeah, you just watch, just watch them. You can take them out of sequence. Same things. I mean, you don't have to. It helps, but like you don't have to watch the the first Ron Burgundy film to, to laugh at the second one. Shut up. You don't. We are not going to agree on that, so we don't want to talk about that. <laughs> oh really? You think you do need to see? I think the first one is far superior. So but I wasn't talking about the superiority of them. Saying I, I don't think you can watch the second one without watching the first one. Really? Alexis did and loved it. All right. Well. Well. You know, she has your genes, so, you know, that's not saying much. <laughs> Burn. Great argument. Uh, Lexi, I think you're really smart. You just have a dumb dad. Uh, <laughs> anyways, but this, uh, please let us know actually how it is. I wonder why his name is not in, uh, oh, here, we actually have a synopsis on YouTube. Synopsis. When six lovers are parted because of an evil conspiracy and revenge in the era of 1490. They cross paths once again in 2019, which those of you doing the math at home, that's exactly 600 years. However, in the present life, the three boys fall in love with the wrong women and are about to marry the sisters-in-law. As destiny would have it, history repeats itself when the three couples end up in Sittengar. Once again, when it all began, will they remember their past lives in time for marriage or will they be stuck with the wrong lovers forever? Houseful Four is coming to confuse you. Put you on a laughing riot and take you through the grandeur of 1419 with a spark of 2019. Come. There was a few more uh, things, but you scroll. That's right. We're done. Come. I like it better with that. Come and witness this epic reincarnation comedy. That's not very often you get to say it's an epic reincarnation comedy. I don't think I've, you've ever said that. I don't know if I've ever said those words. <laughs> Well, that a was... new genre, the epic reincarnation comedies. Well, that was funny. Let us do your thought of it down in the comment section below.